as the start of the uh, Richmond Rovers versus East Coast based trial match here at Greyland Park. The, uh, the senior sides both taking part. They will uh, play in four lots of 20. Uh, the referee for today's trial is uh, Mr. Sam Davis. Richmond with the first touch of the ball. Inside the uh, 22 has been penalised for uh, taking too long. First touch of the ball. Now they take it up the uh, left hand side, takes it, centralises it, and uh, it's driven back by the good defensive uh, for Richmond. Breaks out of one, breaks out of two tackles. Nice pass out to his number, other number 13. There's a lot of double numbers out there. A bit hard to decipher, but uh, we'll get there. Number seven, he flicks it out to uh, number three on the left hand side of centre there. Uh, seven with the ball now and uh, throws three dummies and then uh, takes one to too many dummies and uh, loses the ball in the tackle. Scrum in the uh, first first game's uh, scrummaging. These guys are a little bit more disciplined than trying for top side. So. Oh, uh, left hand side brings it up towards the uh, 40 metre mark. Number two with the ball now for East Coast Bay. So, so this kid's run out of the week and he's got the kind of skill there. Number seven with a quick tap, flicks it out to number ten, number ten right up the centre. And it's tapped on 20, 22 metres out from the... 
the rest of the line. Number 22 is now pace up the left hand side, takes the touch line. Dummy half with number 7, he'll take it out to number 10. No, he won't, he'll throw it out to number 19. 19 long pass out to number 6, and number 6 will pass it out to number 2, that long, young fellow, and to number 4, he cuts inside. Six. And it's tackled about three metres short of the uh, goal line there. Comes out left again now with number eight having a run up the middle. Runs directly into number one for Richmond. Oh, four, move. Seven with the ball left in for number 19. 19 thinks he's a standoff. He's going to flick the ball up in the air and it's taken nicely by number three and uh, gets it down. So number three scores. So. said no conversions, this was seen as a trial, so we just all walk back to halfway. So um, East Coast Bay is a new lead after about seven months. <coughs> now, these teams, um, Richmond came down from uh, Fox from last year, and they'll be in Sharman this year, and uh, they're playing the uh, East Coast Bays, who played in their grand final against Otara last year, so uh, they'll be sort of fairly even matched, I would say. Steps to the left and uh, is tackled by three Be members. Fairy with the ball now for East Coast Bays. Runs up to Muddled up towards the lead short halfway. Seven takes it right out for number 21, I think it is. Comes out to number six. Six goes a little kick through and. Uh, Looking for towards the line, and that dribbles into touch inside the 10. So they have a scrum on the 10 meter mark. Nice little kick for the uh, standoff for East Coast Bays. Showing brightly here at, um, at Grayland Park now, not like it was a few hours ago. But, uh, one o'clock, it was uh, very unpleasant. Ball oh, comes out the right hand side for Richmond and uh, taken out by number four. And, about 15 metres from the goal line. Seven, 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 seven! Seven, seven, seven! Seven, seven, seven! Take that left and another bit of right again. I'm from the 10 with the ball now, taking it up down the middle. And three, up. And it gets 12 metres short of the halfway line. Nice pass, number 13, 13 tackle. Three, three, three! Metres short of the halfway line. Ball comes out to number one, one with a high kick in the air. Who's going to take it? Nobody. And uh, the ball comes up backwards to number two. Number two comes out for East Coast Bay. So a little up there for uh, the East Coast Bay side. Number five runs it out from dummy half and makes it halfway long. Seven picks out to number six. Six gets the ball, picks out the wing, got a bit of pace and he's. Uh, Pulled offside out there, I know, it's a shoulder charge currently by number three for uh, Will goes into touch, we've got uh, on the 25 metre mark. Wait 
You're freaking him on with his shot. Because he brings out there and I won't have no shoes. <laughs> nice spend in there for referee as our son does. Ball comes out to the right hand side, number seven takes it on his own and that's uh, strapped in the corner there. Ball comes out again, it's uh, gone backwards for the referee, number nine into the ball, puts it out number three, number three puts it in number two, drops the ball dead and on the goal post. Enterprise in football, but just the last pair of hands are uh, not the best. Number one runs it through towards the uh, 15 yeah, metres yeah. from the line. It's a tackle. Number four, number one in the dummy. The dummy half, I think it was. Knocked it on. So he's got space for a second chance. A bit hard. To make it's hard for coaches and the uh, players make mistakes when they're in their own 20. And uh, we're just trying to get a run on. And you, uh, Get the ball away. And you put the opposition in a attacking roll again. Six to three just come now. 13 off the back of the front goes uh, left and it's flipped out by number six. Out to number five of the winger and a nice little try by his ghost days. So here we have, they go ahead by two tries to nil. With number five scoring and a about 15 minutes in the first quarter. Space half and a 10 runs it out, lose the ball forward, no uh, control of the ball from the eight it was. Carrying the ball a bit high and uh, contact uh, spills it out. So Richmond the ball now with number 13, takes up the middle towards the line, two four. Come out right hand side number 12. Um, number 12 uh, played part of the game in the first game. Hold up, call for Mr. Davis. Tackle three. Side of the other number one with the ball and a ripple pass over the uh, top of the centre there and knocks it on. So uh, the Davis says uh, both ways, we'll have a scrum out and the East Coast Bays will take the feed. A little bit of cash on the right hand side for Richmond then. from East Coast Bay, so he straightens up and he's tackled on the, the 15 metres out from the goal line. Seven in the dummy half, close to number four. Number four breaks through one tackle, he's tackled on the 30 metre mark. Comes out number 13, cuts back inside, runs back, back towards the defence. This time seven gets it and feeds it to number 21. Seven again with a ball to number six. Six yeah. play standoff inside the 
the uh, cruelty and I didn't make the sideline anyway so it's uh, more room than it would have been inside the uh, 20. short of the halfway line there, yeah, number 14 with the ball, flex out to number one, one goes for the little chip over the top, going for the regather, misses the regather, nobody wants it, number four picks it up for his best base, he picks it, no he doesn't, he comes inside and uh, dummy half is number seven, number seven with the ball and the pass out to number 10, 10 straightens up and goes towards the line, picks it up the back, uh, as he's going to ground, the 13 hits the ball now, he goes with inside the 30, and ball comes out this time, and I just thought Davis is going to call a penalty. Number 14 with the ball, goes uh, and number 10 with the ball this time, straightens up, goes through, runs, runs through, gets to number 13, 13 going towards the line. Which move the ball now, come out the right hand side. Four the ball now for Richmond. He takes it out from 12 metres out from his own goal line. To number 12. Four brings it out another three or four metres. 14 with the ball now. He picks it up to number 13. 13 runs it up to the uh, 30 metres out from the own goal line, Richmond. Take a left with number seven and number thirteen, another number thirteen. <laughs> Can't be. <laughs> it must be different number thirteen. Seven of the ball now. Beats it downfield and it's going to come down into the hands of number two for East Coast Bays, who are running down to the left hand side. Long pass out to his centre number three. Three goes down, cuts inside, pushes off one, pushes off two, cuts back to number two, number two goes away and one catch and he's pretty quick this ball. And he scores underneath the post. So a nice little try scored by East Coast Bays, a bit of a team right there by three to three of the pace. So we're going to head by uh, three tries to none. Kicked off by Richmond. Uh, and down to number six for Roof Coast Bays, who's fast on turn by eight, and he goes through. Ball a bit more secure this time. Carries the ball very high under that uh, the shoulder there, and uh, he's inclined to uh, pop out. Nice kick right under 14 on the bigger boy. Comes out to number 13 for East Coast Bays. He, uh, Goes left now with number 19. This is a one. Long kick and uh, number two quick to chase the young fella down there and uh, tackles him. So number 19, the kicker, um, makes the second tackle. Come on, 
And the try brings it up the middle towards the uh, 10 metre mile inside their own half, makes another couple of three metres and ends up a metre short of the halfway line. Christian with the ball now, out to number 16, the new player on the paddock in the white shorts, and uh, he gets tackled 12 metres inside the East Coast Bay's half. Down here, number two, the um, young uh, boy playing at fullback for East Coast Bay. So, uh, he breaks out of two tackles and runs through, and he spins through the middle. And the one tackles him inside uh, Richmond's own half, number 15, right into uh, the dummy half. Nice little run by that number two. Very talented boy. Back, you're holding him down up. Talk us out. Yeah, number six with the ball for uh, East Coast Bays because they get the penalty from pulling down too long. Number seven and a half back for uh, Richmond. Back five. One day. Just coming up to the uh, first out of 20 minutes now. Just waiting to get the, the eye of the referee. Four goes through for East Coast Bays and uh, it's tackled about three metres short of the line. Number six passes out to number 19. Number 19 with the ball now passes to the ground and number three is going to pick it up and uh, try to straighten up. He tries to straighten up in the middle and uh, has a man with him. Number five doesn't look for him again. Three up there. Here tackle called by Mr. Davis. Referee seven and dummy half. Scoots out left hand side. Number 22 goes into touch. And then we have the end of the first 20 minutes. All right, with the uh, score of two tries to none to uh, East Coast Bays here at uh, Richmond Rovers Park, Braylon, back after the first quarter. Again, yeah, back here live at uh, Grayland Park for the second quarter. And the uh, referee's explaining now. The ball's knocked on by East Coast Bay, so at the end of that first quarter, and therefore we're going to start with a scrum at the uh, Richmond feed. Just waiting on uh, the player to come on for East Coast Bay. They haven't got a fullback apparently. So. The young fellow number two thought he was off. So we uh, go with the scrum now, 14 fed the ball in and it's coming out the left hand side to number one and one takes it up and gives it pass to number three. And number 16, he's tapped uh, two minutes out of the, out of the 22, 20 metre line. Number two with the ball now and he's tackled. Another low yards made there. Run through the middle by Richmond. Yeah, that's up to the 12 metre mark inside their own half. It comes out the right hand side, number 16, that dummy half. And it's kicked through by uh, number three. And number, he's picked it onto number two. Number two for East Coast Bays. He uh, runs it up the middle and he's got uh, four guys in there. Oh, I've oh, oh, oh. seen him run in the first half. Ball goes out this time to number five and runs five runs it out uh, nine oh, minutes inside his own half. Number seven out to number ten. Number ten with the ball now. Oh, he gets it eight metres inside the uh, Richmond half. Seven with the ball now to number six. What's he going to do? It not going to kick. No, he's going to be tackled. So oh, he's Eight metres inside the Richmond half. Number seven with the ball now. He didn't know what to do with it. And he's put the kick in through and it's gone in. Into touch on the 20 metre mark. There's two players there. Didn't, uh, so we weren't sure what to do with the ball. Number six and then it was number seven. So, uh, to, uh, 
Very nice. Two weeks, let's see. Uh, championship starts. The 11th of April. So it's uh, all going. Both teams, these teams here, and uh, the other 13 teams in the Shaman Cup. Number two hasn't uh, played a ball. He walked up, a, walked over the top of the ball, didn't bother playing the ball correctly, and uh, this is something we see every th Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and Monday in the NRL where uh, players are not playing the ball correctly. It's in the rule book, and they need to do it properly. It's quick and easy to do, so. You know. One of the most simple parts of the game. They just get lazy. Number 19 defeats Spun out for his first base. Number 3 takes the ball off him and uh, runs up. And gets inside the 30. Number 7 at uh, dummy half. Feeds it out to number 10 for uh, the prop from his coast base. Who puts it out to number 3 in the centre again for his coast base. And up the left hand side. He's tackled about 8 minutes short of the go line. Number seven with the ball again, two dummies, then he turns around and changes pass to the right hand sort of pass. Obviously it's a problem with passing it to the right. Goes out again, pass that from a six, six got the ball now and pass that from a five, five runs through the middle, then goes from nine. And comes out to number nine and what does he do with it? He grab it, kicks it through and it comes off. The feet, of the, uh, the feet and hands of the Richmond player lying on the ground there, and uh, number 13 runs across and scores the most easiest try that he will ever score in a game of rugby league. Tomorrow he will have said he ran 50 metres to score that try and so to 12 players, but uh, he didn't. <laughs> Hard luck for that Richmond player, that you know, was one of those things to bounce the ball. That's why the ball's oval, it goes anyway. trying to get a drink now off Mr. McIntyre because he's having a panic, so. Long kick down by Richmond and uh, taken by number six for Chico Space. He passes out to his number 21. Number 20 run runs it up and still wrestling the tackle. Play the ball, please. Number four with the ball now, here's the run, comes up here, it's a 15 metres short of the halfway line. Number seven in the dummy half, out to number 13, 13 with the ball again and runs it up, and puts up five metres from the halfway. Seven with the ball again, out to number six, and three out to number 12. Nineteen, and there's a kick to the ball there. A high kick down there. Well taken by the number nine for uh, the Russian young fella. High so step down, goes two, and then cut off low out to the right hand side. Here's number three, and number three gets up and plays the ball. Number fourteen into dummy half, and uh, runs it out. Six of the ball now, pass out to number eight. Eight. Looks to pass it out to uh, the number 15, but he oh. gave up and came out the right hand side. He got it this time. Number 6 with the ball now. Now they go left, and it's 22 that runs it straight down. And I saw the round four down. Nice offload to number 2 to, to um, Richmond, who scores from the left hand corner there. A nice little try scored by them. Uh, 22 coming on with the burst, and now to uh, the number 2. So. Nice try after six and a half minutes in this uh, second quarter.
back down to number three, feeds it out to his number eight. Number eight comes up the middle. He's tackled uh, 35 metres from his own line. Number six into dummy half. Off goes out to... Uh, number 10 it was. Here, number, here comes number 22 again on the burst. He comes up for a 10 metre mark inside their own half. Blocks behind the post there. Number two Good hit up head ups by Richmond and uh, coming to the halfway after five tackles and uh, good work. Number six with the ball now. Goes to number 14. 14 left foots it down field towards the, uh, the in goal in line. And number 15 runs it out for East Coast Bays and gets caught about 16, 17 minutes out from the goal. Line. Number five with the ball now for. Uh, East Coast Bays, he runs it up and well tackled by number two, number six here. Back to number two, I think it is for uh, East Coast Bays, yes, it is, and who? <coughs> Seven to dummy half, he's out to number ten, number ten brings it up and try and go off the road. Richmond come up with the ball, number, number three picks it up, a nice little kick up off the ground there. Six for the ball, pass it to number 22. He's a man that's set up for the first try. Six again at dummy half. Feeds it out to number 14. 14 straightens up. Goes towards the line and he's tackled about 12 metres short of the line. Six again at the dummy half. Tries to go himself and he's tackled by three uh, East Coast players defenders there. Good job on the ball, Peter. So we'll have an East Coast Bay's uh, feed. So we're to 10 minutes into the second dollar 20, so halfway through the second dollar 20. Pass and uh, comes off. Back there again is number 19. He feeds it on to number 13. 13 uh, gets tackled and it's uh, gone now to number 10. He brings it up 10 metres from the uh, half high line, the own half. Number 7 into dummy half again. He feeds it out to number 22, perhaps. On to number 19. Comes back again on left hand side, number 3. He goes round 1. And still looking for the offload here. And, he's, and of course, no, he's played the ball. I'm you played it. Number three. You played it. 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 This guy's play is now taking it up to within the, the 20 metre mark. Goes up to number 19, 19 up to 6, and 6 on to 13. 13 cuts back inside, so it's a straight mark. Go down the middle. 7 with the ball again. He throws out to number 5. Number 5 with the ball. Pass out to number 4, and it's. Um, it ends up in the winger's hand, the right winger's hands there, and uh, passes forward. We can credit the, uh, the weather here in Auckland at the moment. It's, um, Fine, one minute and rain down the next one. Uh, no rain now, nice uh, sunny day here at uh, Grayland Park for Richmond Rovers home okay. ground. Richmond threw out with a ball and came out the right hand side. He lost at number 14. And 
Here's the ground, takes the tackle out. Comes out for number eight for uh, Richmond. Freedom, go! Half, and now 22 comes through the middle again and uh, takes it to the bring him down. Yeah, Number 14 with the ball. He kicks the ball from outside the uh, 40 metre mark. And number 5 not taking a lot of time to get back there because he thinks it's going to go. <laughs> There's a touch, but it doesn't. He has to pick it up and then have to run it in a meter or two. Lack of discipline there by the um, number two player there. And it's sort of give Mr. Davis a bit of a gob for him. No one there. But, uh, he's in control. And now they've lost... Uh, 40 metres. Coach killer. Oh, he's watching that. Okay. Bring up for uh, East Coast Bays, number 15. Throws the ball into the, uh, the player that's going to take the tap and still oh, came back very slowly oh. in the field of play and in an offside position. So... Uh, you have to take note of that in the competition because you'll be picked up for it. Number 13 runs it out to East Coast Bays. Seven metres from inside the Richmond half. Out to number six, out to number 19. 19 into three. Three combined as well. Out to three and 19 and three. Cuts into the rest of the afternoon. Sam didn't know which way to turn. But be it anyway. Goes out to the right hand side again by number six to number four. Number four going towards the line. Out to number 12, number 12 long pass out to 19, 19 steps one player, tries to step the second player, he does and gets tackled by the three other players and uh, the ball comes loose and there's an advantage being played here by uh, Mr. Davis. It's a hand over to uh, Richmond so there's no advantage there. Richmond running out. Yeah, no. He's trying to look for his number. Oh. He's caught up. It's okay. Comes away with uh, oh, number 14. It was passed out to number 18. That is three guys. He's still up to the 10 meter, 10 meters inside his own half. The ball comes out the right hand side now. There. Number two takes it up, goes out to number three. Number three with the ball now. Long pass out to his little um, winger. Goes out the back, uh, number 19, feeds up to number 6, he pass on number two, 5, and 5 takes the inside oh, yeah, of the yeah, yeah, half, and oh. as you heard the referee say, we're going to run the 6, and uh, saying a trial, so 4 goes through the ball, he makes it out 10 metres, and uh, plays uh, within the 10. You went sideways, you went sideways, that's where you went, sideways. Three goes plays on the tag now. I mean, we've only got probably one, one set of six to go. It could be uh, half time then, so the end of the second quarter. He's re reiterated that it's the last set of six, and uh, once again, that winger doesn't know the rule.
Tackle goes up to number 10. And these tackles short on the line. Comes out left hand side, number 19. He flicks out to number 5. Number 5 heads towards the uh, line, cuts inside, but uh, is tackled. 7 with the ball now. Flicks out to number 3. Number 3 with the ball now, going towards the line. And, uh, called Hal by Mr. Davis. Comes out again to the right hand side, number 10 with the ball now. He'll offload it to number 21. He plays that there. Number 21, he goes back inside, goes towards the line. He's trying to get it down now. And so Dave said it was tackled short of the line and it was stolen, so it's a penalty to his base. Turn to the ball now. One of the Seven fixes it out the right hand side to number six. Um, six goes on to number four and he's taken by three before the lock try line again. That's three times for him, down the four. Through the line, comes out again. It's going to. You know, And there we have it, it's uh, second out of 20, so we've got half time there here at Grayland Park, we have the, um, the visiting side leading by three tries to one, so we'll be back after half time. So we're back here live at uh, Grayland Park, and we're, because it was half time, we've uh, the teams have decided, to, well the coaches have decided to be uh, one lot of 30 minutes now, so they've got 30 minutes to go for the end of the game. So, uh, <laughs> somebody's been smart at there, so Mr Davis says I'll we'll deal with that, we'll go for it just for him. But no, uh, they'll be playing 30 minutes in this uh, half and uh, that'll be it. I mean, it's just a trial, two weeks time, it's a big day for... Um, the Shaman Cup kickoff. Just playing for a ball now. The ball goes, hits into the uh, middle there and uh, East Coast Bay's come up with a good little kick off there. They must have been watching the nines so um, played in February. Well, most of the kicks were like that. And uh, flag goes up. But, uh, Mr Davis says one there. Play it there. Number 10 with the ball now for East Coast Bay's. A one flick pass out the back to number 19. He takes on to number 13. 13 is tackled on the uh, 20 metre mark. Goes out to number six. Number five receives it from him inside to number four. Number four does the dive and uh, over the top of the tackle. And uh, <coughs> dummy half is number 14 out to number six to number 22. 22 with a run up the middle. Nice flick pass inside into number 13. And 13 is flattened on his back. Comes out the right hand side again. The long, long pass out to number four. And he's flattened. Uh, if I can see it. There it is there. I'm a bit of a hill here at uh, Grayland Park to uh, film this uh, match. Ball gets quite high in the air and taken out of the air nicely by, um, by number three. Taken out of the air nicely by number three and uh, didn't get directly to ground straight away but then rolled over and uh, forced a try. So early points on the board for East Coast Bay. a minute and three quarters gone in this uh, second half. So we're not having kickoffs.
This is a try scorer, last one back. Wonder I couldn't find him. Rick can kick off now, deep down. It comes off the uh, hand of uh, the uh, East Coast base player. But disgusted himself, gave himself away then too. Put his head down and uh, so the referee calls him off on. Ball's out the uh, right hand, left hand side for Richmond. Here's to number 14. 14 plays out to number 5. Number 5 decides to cut back inside instead of taking, uh, taking the uh, defender on and he has a winger outside him. But, uh, number, two, number 9 passes out to number 4 and it ends up with number. Number one is here on the bunker. Three, up the Seven in uh, front of the post to play the ball now. It goes out right hand side. Right, number right. seven, it's called back and right, right, right. cut through by number 19 for East Coast Bays. And uh, so zero count will start again. But he lost the ball. So the hard luck with the Richmond there. They uh, took advantage of that kick through and it didn't work out. takes out the back of the scrum and One takes it out to number two and goes with the ball. There it is. And there's the other number two for East Coast Bays. We're running it up now. Well, a little confusing when they're on the two twos and uh, two twelves on the rich inside and, and the other ones are uh, recording. Three out of the one. straightens up and goes up to 10 metres inside his own half, holding into dummy half and uh, throws a couple of dummies, throws it out to number 12, he brings it up a couple of metres short of the halfway line, goes out to number 19, 19 with a kick, he's a uh, pretty useful kicker this number 19, so uh, not sure where they found him. Six, uh, making a tackle on a bit of ball there and uh, forcing him back with the help of his uh, number 13. Number two runs it out for uh, Richmond. He runs it up for uh, 32 metres out from his own goal line. He plays on the park uh, this half. Number nine sets his mate up there. Number Yes, yes, and uh, he gets driven up, driven into the ground three metres short of the halfway line. The ball goes out the right hand side to number seven, seven out to 15, 15 a nice pass out to, uh, I think it's number 14 out there. Last oh, oh, oh. nice, they uh, decide to kick the ball and number 10 going to take it from the... Uh, and then go on line and uh, takes it up to the 20. There's a tip, takes it away, takes it out the right hand side. He's got a bit of pace, long to lean boy. Got a good feed on him too. And uh, gets up and uh, just tackled it eventually by the uh, number six from uh, Richmond. Out to number 14, 14 out to 10. 10 runs up the middle. He's now. 23, me 23 metres inside Richmond half, 14 in dummy half again, he goes left hand side again to 19, 19 passes out to number 12, and number 12 tries to offload, loses the ball, no it's been stolen, 9 has been penalised from Richmond. So they take the tap, and number 10 uh, takes it forward, the only way he knows where to go. That's a sort of pop to go with. Silly little play of the ball there, and uh, untidy of the referee. 
So we'll have a scrum with the Richmond C now. They're on their 10 metre mark. So we're uh, nearly eight minutes gone in this uh, last half, second half. Ball's out now, Richmond, Richmond bringing it out left hand side, number six it is. Oh, it's taken man. back, driven back by the uh, defence. Second Time out the right hand side, number seven, please are back in number six, and number six is Chad. Chad, we've got Paul Chad on, and uh, he's going to number 13, so on the 10 metre mark for the last half. It's a good hurt there, number six, we were hard work. Hard work in the middle of uh, standoff. Spectators out here today, Graylin. So, uh, cruising with the uh, two teams here. Oh, it's blood in his ear, not mud. I thought he said mud. Yeah, it's number six, has got blood in his ear, so he's been taken to the front one. And kick down, and uh, not trying to touch this time, and number two has it for his best days, the young player, brings it up. Seven. Oh. Oh, the Fracas here, number 15 from Richmond, uh, trying to bounce down on the uh, East Coast players' head, which four players came in from there. So. Poor discipline. Still. Bang and Rich! Where's the 
So he goes base with the ball now, number six, uh, flicks it out the back for number two. Number two comes up the middle and uh, we sort of didn't need this in this game because it's a friendly game and it's on um, trial and with this standard of football you should be uh, more disciplined. So, uh, Starts if they just um, hang on around the head there, and that's um, total disregard to discipline. Mr. Piranara will be uh, having a talk to one of his players, I would say, and uh, Mr. McIntyre should be talking to his players not to retaliate and stay out of it. Well, I would hope they would. Those have been in big trouble during the season. We go down now with number 22 going into the first tackle down towards the line. 14 pass out to number 6. 6 pass out to number 2. 2 flicks it out nicely to number 3. Number 3 cuts inside. And the line's stuck and he's going through to underneath the post. So we're going for their second try of the, uh, the third quarter, if you like to call them quarters, but this is the second half. Be set to the same and move on to the sideline. Both players. That's what he means. <clears throat> he goes by his run out with number 10. Number 14 and dummy half. He passes in number 22. 22 passes wildly out to Mr. Nobody. And number 13 has to cover up. And number 13, the other number 13, he takes the ball off him and uh, runs it up 25 metres short of the halfway line. Uh, leaning going on with the uh, play the ball and put a shoulder in and come in with a game. So number three's been picked up for that. Pretty silly if so, um, you know. We're trying to clean this up out of our game and they used to silly players like that that just they keep bringing it back in. Knocked down touch, number five runs it out for Richmond and uh, Number 13. Number 12 for the ball now. Pass that to number 8. Nice flick pass by number 8. Out to number 7. He flicks it out for number 3. Up a little 